Paul, I've enjoyed being here with you again. Two years ago, you and I hung out at the AMA conference, so it's been a lot of fun to see you again. Absolutely. Um, AMA is always a great time. Yes, it is. What are your big takeaways? I mean, we're in like almost the end of day two. Um, not much tomorrow, half day or so. What are the things that kind of are bubbling up in your head that you'll think about when you get back? Well, I think it's, it's always, AMA is always a good chance to uh, kind of take stock, um, especially when you're, uh, when you're leading an office. Take stock and how is your team doing? Are you headed in the right direction from a strategy standpoint? Are you thinking about the right things? Uh, you might not have all the answers, but are you asking the right questions? And I think that AMA gives you a chance with uh, the higher level of the sessions and the conversations to really think from a, a strategy standpoint. Um, you know, I've been uh, struck by how many sessions there are compared to last year on content strategy. Okay. That's a, a buzzword, I think, that, that right. everyone is talking about. Right. Um, and I don't know that everyone is defining it. Well, I think we're talking about content strategy, but you're seeing people really um, looking at, at the different buckets that you put content in instead of moving towards the strategy mm -hmm. component. So I, I think that's one takeaway is, mm -hmm. is how do you really hone in on the strategy component of your, of your content, not just are we going to put it on Facebook or are we going to put it on the website or right. we'll go in the alumni magazine. Right. Um, the other uh, piece, there's actually there's less social media, straight social media it seemed like, okay. uh, more integrated social media, which okay. is uh, Well, social media is so good. mainstream now. It's so mainstream I mean, now. probably, I don't know, has it been three or four years that you've been coming to these conferences? That's right. I mean, I wonder if three or four years ago it was all about, should we do social? How, what is the role should of social Should we be on Facebook? Right, you know? right, right, right. And now it's just sort of another right. channel. We have to answer yeah. one more time, should the admissions office have its own Facebook page, right. you know? Right. Uh, get a little tired of those conversations. Yeah. The, the other big takeaway for me and, and what I always enjoy is just like, like you talked about three years ago when we remember standing in the hallway and yeah. having a long conversation with yeah. you about yeah. uh, our roles is, is the networking, but not the networking that happens at, at the networking breakfasts right. or the networking lunches right. or the you know table. the yeah. round tables or whatever it might be, but it's the networking that happens, um, you know, breakfast, I met a colleague. Mm -hmm. uh, this morning that uh, we've known each other now for five years and back and forth and mm -hmm. what's going on in, in her world and mm -hmm. and uh, a drink here or a, a reception here and and that really that chance I, I think in communications to get to know your colleagues um, it's not so competitive that we're withholding information mm -hmm. from each other it's there's so much great sharing mm -hmm. that happens and I'm so appreciative of that yeah here. yeah I was all I always remember being so surprised at how open people were when you would call other campuses, mm -hmm. even competitors, and they would yep. share anything with you. Yeah, yep. we got that, we'll send it your way. And I share so almost anything. You share almost, almost anything. anything. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. So will you come back next year, and what do you think the big topics will be next year? I mean, you've mentioned content strategy as being something that was huge this year. What do you What do you expect to see on the agenda next time around? Um, well, it's in Austin next year. Right. I've never been to Austin, so right. uh, that sounds good to start with. Right. You know, location, location, location. <laughs> um, you know, I think that we'll still be talking about content strategy. I think we'll still be trying to figure that out. Mm -hmm. I, I think, you know, um, I was, uh, you know, we were part of a session today that mm -hmm. was tying content strategy and brand strategy. Mm -hmm. I think yeah. that you'll see more of that right. next year because it's, it's not going to be one or the other. You're going to have to do both right. um, together. Right. Uh, I'm a bit surprised uh, that I didn't hear more of the responsive word mm, today. Okay. Um, right. in, and, and in regards people, to, like, in regards to web responsive design. web design. Right. Um, so I wonder if that's just either too far in the weeds or if that will be coming yeah. um, back around. A lot of people are, are are at least talking about it in some of the web circles that right. that, um, right. that I that I follow. Um, I haven't heard much about mobile in general now that no. you mention it. That's a really good point. There was one tweet yeah. that was going around whether it's responsive design, a mobile site, or an app. Right. Yesterday. Right, right, right. right. Um, you know, and I, I think right. I tweeted, um, you know, why not all of them? But right. uh, who knows yeah. what the right answer is. Do you guys is. have an app at Gettysburg College? We do. What, what does your app do? So we have an iPhone app and an Android app that is admissions perspective student okay. driven. We also developed an iPad app that is okay. a news app. So you okay. get our news general news feed or in the media news feed and our right. athletic news feed as okay. well. What does the admissions one look like? So, um, you know, do? like take a tour of campus, okay. you know, phone numbers. Okay. Really, really the idea that you're coming to visit campus, what are the tools that you, right. that you are that going you to need. need. Okay. Yep. Okay. Great. Well, that sounds 
good. Well, thank you so much for the time. It's Absolutely. Been, Always good to catch up with my... It's been a pleasure to chat uh, formally and informally with absolutely. you over the last couple of days. Great. Thanks a Thanks. lot.